Good morning dear children let us continue with chapter number 25 that is community health and hygiene subject science standard 6 this is our part 2 children we learn in the last part about community health and the importance of community health children in this part we will see about wholesome living tobacco consumption and ill effects of tobacco addiction let's begin children now speak and write some important factors that are harmful for community health are mentioned below for example children polluted water that means the water is not clean malnutrition now malnutrition means children you are not getting the proper food to fill the stomach is not the important part that we can eat anything but are you getting all the vitamins in it all the minerals are you getting proper carbohydrates protein fats everything is required for our body so if you don't get that that is called malnutrition how each of these factors are harms community health is given in the first box in front of it some suggested remedies are mentioned in the next box add other ill effects and remedies to the respective boxes so if you want you can add some more also children now the first one children that they have given that is polluted water because of the polluted water what can happen children yeah you can get cholera typhoid jaundice all this spread because of the dirty water so what they have given you you should have safe water supply boil the water or filter the water next one malnutrition higher number of child death that is small kids they died because they don't get proper food due to poverty so what is the cure for that proper diet children yeah exactly that is nutritious diet the next problem is children pollution danger to the environment now this pollution i told you children it can be air pollution it can be water pollution it can be noise pollution which can affect your ears and it can also be land pollution that means everything is covered with garbage sometimes you can also have soil pollution that means children because of lot of chemicals and fertilizers pesticides even the soil gets polluted so due to the pollution there is spread of diseases also children so now what's the way you have to protect your environment like children if cutting trees is a bad for the environment then what is the solution yeah exactly you plant trees the next one is children that is ignorance and superstition ignorance means people don't know only and superstition means children they believe in many things that is called blind faith just because of it the olden days people used to say something they continue some practices like operation deception deception means children cheating sometimes people they believe in babas and all okay next one is children addiction because of that you have unhappy family life if one man drinks and comes then he beats his son all his money spent on drinking he doesn't pay for those children school fees or for eating food then the happy life becomes unhappy life due to addiction people health can also be affected it may leads to cancer also so now what is the problem here 
addiction so what is the solution yeah d addiction program educating people about ill effects of addictions okay till here have have you understood your children so two things that we saw one depend on yourself and actually even the pollution and all many of the problem it depends a lot on ourselves we can keep ourselves healthy sometimes you can't help it now if it is in the air somebody else has and because of that you get but as much as possible we can try to help ourselves children and be healthy okay next one is children that is wholesome living now what does wholesome living mean that means children in good living there are many aspects if we take care of our health it is possible for us to lead a wholesome life keeping ourselves happy and taking an interest in things avoiding feelings of hatred and envy now what is envy children yeah let us see envy means jealousy so don't get angry or don't feel envy okay jealousy is not a good thing okay children that person has this i don't have so some people want and then they feel very upset so that is a bad habit and doing what is necessary to maintain physical health help us to achieve this and here and means children go now children if people of a society live in a healthy and wholesome life social tension also decreases tension or stress that also worries us a lot it creates problem so stress or tension is the same thing okay so when you have more problems you will have more tension social tension also decreases the feelings of friendship which can be nurtured so you should have good feelings towards each other you live in harmony don't be angry don't be jealous and then you can have a good life children okay next one is children tobacco consumption how it can be harmful everywhere children you will see in like theaters and all okay smoking is injurious to health that means children it is a bad for your health still people will be smoking they know that they can get cancer they can get lung cancer they can get throat cancer they can get mouth cancer still you will find that they chew tobacco they smoke or they put it in their pipes so they have got bad habits so that bad habit has to be removed names of tobacco products such as gutka cigarettes beads misiri mana pan masala etc are often heard okay so you might have heard all these things masiri some people even brush their teeth with tobacco okay they roast tobacco and they brush their teeth why you have good toothpaste or tooth powder use that why do you use such tobaccos yeah children children we also see many people consuming tobacco in different ways all these are harmful for our health it is not good for our health at first a person may chew tobacco casually at someone's urging urging it means children encouraging someone to do don't even try even if your friend is smoking if your friend is happy having tobacco don't try it okay it is something which is bad even if you are curious to know about sometime you must have seen 
boys they have little peer pressure peer pressure it means children other boys will put pressure but don't even and give up okay into that peer pressure don't even try to be go at first a person may chew it casually but this may lead to the addiction slowly you might become an addict the person becomes dependent on tobacco and cannot give up the habit so people say i want to give up i know it is a bad habit but i can't i have habit see bad habits are very easy to learn children but they are very difficult to remove correct so children when people develop this habit they become restless if they don't get to be cool restless it means children they must have it they want to have it and they cannot manage without that they are not able to pay attention to anything else they have to have tobacco in the mouth all the time when the habit reaches children this stage then it is called an addiction when they have to have it or they must have it people addicted to tobacco children spit here and there all the time they make their surroundings very dirty after they chew the tobacco they then they spit over here spit over there and then even around it is very dirty children let's see what are the ill effects of or we can say bad effects of tobacco addiction the first one children you can get ulcer in the mouth when ulcer in the mouth it is very painful when you are eating something like spicy that time it will be start burning or even when you are talking and all continuously over there it will be pain inside the mouth the second problem is children the ulcer develops into bigger wounds first it it is only a small boil we can say and ulcer then develop into the bigger wound or the person may develop tumors also now children tumor if it is a malignant it can be cancerous also a lot of time and money has to be spent on treatment okay if the wounds do not heal it, it means children if they don't become okay the person has serious problems and this can eventually leads to a cancer eventually it means children finally you can get cancer only tobacco entering the digestive organ now you have learned all your digestive organ that means children your large intestine your small intestine your stomach all these when tobacco enters all your digestive organs it leads to a complaints related to them they then you will have lot of complaints maybe you will have indigestion and lot of problems inside the constant presence constant means children continuous presence of tobacco in digestive organ can cause cancer of any of those organ that means children you can get stomach cancer also you can get liver cancer you can get any part which is inside a person who develops cancer in this way has to take very painful treatment children it is called chemotherapy all your hair will fall and your immunity goes down it is very very painful even after that one cannot be sure that cancer will be cured sometimes cancer it can happen even though you don't smoke that is different case but when you smoke a lot or when you chew tobacco that time you can get more often cancer of the mouth or the throat or the stomach or any part where that cancer is affecting you children now children today we will stop our lesson here okay and remaining chapter we will continue in the next part children Thank you.
stay safe